What are we talking about today? Spider Co. Shaman M4. And Police 4 K390. This was sent to me by Tim Gannon. Tim sent me knives before to test and check out. This has a regrind by Brian at Transparent Knives. And I personally measured eight thousandths behind the edge, uh, all the way up to the tip. And it is at 15 degrees per side. Same finish. Strop the same way as always. This was sent to me by Kurt. JCoolG19 on Instagram and YouTube. To test, do a 30-day carry with, which I haven't filmed yet for you guys. I did record all the cutting and everything I did with it. Just got to get that video done. We'll talk about this in a minute. After we watch the cutting, as well as the Shaman, which if you guys don't know how I feel about this knife... You're definitely going to find out in this video. I'm going to go ahead and watch the cutting. And I'm going to super speed it up so it's really short. And we'll come back and talk about how this pair did. All right, now that we saw that, let's go ahead and talk about both of these. We will go ahead and start with the Shaman. As you can see, Kurt did test this twice, and 
it was 64.6 and 64.6 for hardness harder than any m4 i've tested before i i usually like to test these things before i know the hardness in some cases that's not possible like this particular pair this one has also been tested, and it was 65.4. So I was really curious to see how these two compared, seeing as that they are less than one point away in hardness. Start with the M4. And I don't recall how many edges were on here. I believe Tim put one or two. I put a couple on it before I went ahead and started testing it just to be sure. And on the first test, this did 209 feet fine edge and 369 feet working edge, which is a great result. The M4 I've tested in the past, some of it I've known to be 63. Some of it, I guessed, was around 63, maybe 63 and a half. Most of that usually does 180 to 190 feet fine edge and mid 330, you know, maybe 340 feet working edge. So that, that's a good bump for from the extra hardness in this one. The second test to verify... I got 210 feet fine edge and 372 feet working edge. Absolutely nothing wrong with this. Awesome performer. Very close to, if you notice the 4V video that I just put out, it's this was creeping up on what the 4V did. Uh, it's a little off on fine edge, but it's definitely there on working edge. I have no complaints about how this performed. And we'll move on to the K390. The K390, I had put a few edges on it. I ran the 30 days of use for this on the fourth edge. So I tested on the 5th and 6th edge, and I still have to sharpen it up so I can get it back to Kurt. The first test on this, I got 195 feet fine edge, 414 feet working edge. And for the second test, 193 feet fine edge, 417 feet working edge absolutely nothing wrong with that great performance i didn't think i was going to like this knife at first it is pretty big those of you that have one already know but as you can tell you're looking at about three quarters of an inch on each end at least did end up really liking this once you carry it for a few days at least to me it does not feel as big as it actually is did really well during the 30 days like i said i will cover that was absolutely happy with the performance i had no problem sharpening this stropping it deburring it Anything like that. I had not used a whole lot of K390 before this. Just a little bit here and there. I did really enjoy using it. I'll talk more about that in the 30 days video when I cover it. The M4. When Tim sent this along... He did say carry it for a couple days, use it, and see if I felt any differently about the Shaman. And 
I'm going to say right now for, from the video I did on my own to this one, I nothing changed. I don't find it to be a comfortable knife to use. This is one huge giant hot spot right here with this compression lock. This definitely could have used a different lock. Be it the ball lock, a back lock, something. Would have made this such a better knife. The clip also would have to go. That is a huge hot spot for me in use. About the only way it isn't is I find myself cutting like this a lot in a pinch type grip and in this grip the compression lock does still bother me but the clip falls in a spot where it doesn't bother my my hand at all for use the geometry on this is awesome very nice to use very nice to test i did enjoy actually cutting with the blade not so much the handle So, no surprises there. Absolutely nothing changed about this. You know, unfortunately, I do like the way it looks, but it it just doesn't do it when I'm actually using it. So, that's all I have on these two. If you have any questions, comments, anything, put them down below. I'll be happy to talk about them, but that is how mid-64 M390 and mid-65 K390, I'm sorry, M390, M4 and K390 did. That's all I have. As always, I appreciate your time and thanks for watching.